The Pismo Beach Monarch Butterfly Grove is seeing a large decline in monarchs for the upcoming winter season. KSBY News reporter Alice Becerra spoke with experts at the Grove on what may be causing the decline. Alice? Megan, although the numbers are significantly lower than they have been in previous years, there are still ways the community can get involved in order to help increase the number of monarchs that are coming into Pismo Beach this winter season. Milkweed is essential to monarch butterflies. No milkweed, no monarchs. That's the end of it. Heather Risco has been volunteering at the Monarch Butterfly Grove for 15 years and says she's seen a major decrease in the number of monarchs in the last couple of years. In the biggest time period ever, in the 80s, there were possibly 5 to 10 million monarchs overwintering in California. Last year, there was an entire total of 28,000. Warmer temperatures are causing the monarchs to leave the grove almost a month early, which then leads the monarchs leaving the grove before the milkweed is ready. That milkweed is especially important for the mother monarch. She must lay the egg right on the milkweed. Herbicides getting into the groundwater and affecting the monarchs that are close by are another potential factor in the decline. As of Sunday afternoon, the Pismo Beach Butterfly Grove had between 900 and 1,000 monarchs. That number is significantly lower than last year's 3,000 at the same time. John and Amy Amos are visiting California from Michigan and say they believe helping conserve groves like this one is of the utmost importance. They could have another grove similar start growing it up, start planning ahead for 20 years down the road when this grove might not work anymore. That'd be even better. Monarchs are counted officially between Thanksgiving and the first 10 days of December when every monarch is expected to be where they will spend winter. They are then recounted in January. Bisco says those who live more than five miles from an established grove or the ocean can help the monarchs by planting native milkweed. Make sure it's native. You can just go to your local nursery or hardware store or you can go online and find out what is native to your area. And if you want a simple way to help out with the decline, you can plant nectar plants regardless of where you live on the central coast. That nectar will then help replenish the monarchs. In San Luis Obispo, Alice Becerra, KSBY News.